Harassment. Totally harassment. What's up, everybody? My name is Lehua, and welcome to the Superfina channel. I am a Hawaii variety content creator, host of podcasts across worlds, and I stream on twitch.tv slash Lehua Superfina. Today, we are reacting to Ascendance of a Bookworm. And if you like anime reactions, don't forget to subscribe, ring the bell so you can be notified on the next upload. And if you would like to support the channel, we got channel membership, Patreon, and merchandise. Link to those are below. We are reacting to Ascendance of a Bookworm episode 29, season 3, episode 3. So we got left off where they're ordering her to become adopted by a noble. The dedication ceremony and spring arrives. You know, greedy people, greedy adults can get so shady. It's, ugh. It's amazing how personal motivation, motives and such just changes people. Shame, shame, shame. Ooh, both worlds meeting each other again. Oh, is she is flirting. Is she acting bashful? Putting that hair against her face like a fan. Oh, so cute. Ooh, she's learning how to read and write. Oh, they're going to have more stuff in common. What else? <laughs> She's got permission to move around now. <laughs> That's all she cares about. Oh, it's going to be like a library. Taking out books. Borrowing them. Oh, oh. Oh, I like this. The last episode was getting kind of depressing. There's a there's more humor in this episode. Oh. I feel like that high priest has a thing for Pretty girls. Ooh, it's the skeevy guy. Suspicious. He has such a, like, a sour face. Like him. Matching sour faces. Ooh, he looks like he's gonna snatch off that hair ornament.
but he didn't. Look at that guy do that smirk back there. I like how in these like little chibi scenes, they have like the designs on his robe and on her dress or robes, his sash, her robes. There are so many items. She could be like, take my mana. <laughs> Sheesh kebab. Are they glowing? They're glowing. I feel like later on in the story, these items are going to be used for something else. You have business with the in the nobles district. She's the only one who can participate in the ritual with him. Are they doing this every day? Is he holding a, a bag? I thought I was holding like a jar and it's going to be filled with liquid. What you want, high priest? Eh? Is he giving her more work? Oh dear. He's abusing his power. I feel like he just grabbed any kind. Just to have her put mana in it. <laughs> he thought she was going to lose control. Because what the high priest was doing was jerky. I don't mind making you look good once in a while. <laughs> mm -hmm. Cute. Everybody's like celebrating some type of event in their life. Welcome to our parts. Is it difficult? Is it really that difficult? You can see how much of a genius she is. 
It's here! For mass production! Is she eyeballing it? <laughs> oh, dang, that's hard. Is it? Did he meet your expectations? Truly Gutenberg. <laughs> but they don't know who Johannes Gutenberg is! They don't know who this is! Girl! He says, I want no part! <laughs> Did you faint? Oh dear! She got too excited. Oh, and she was also um, releasing a lot of mana too, right? Can't forget about that. She's been overworked and overexcited. Double whammy. <laughs> oh, he shook his head. Wolf has died? <gasps> Dang. They were... Wolf was disposable, yo! Use and toss. Dang. Our family never likes to visit the temple. It's always heavy stuff. Don't get mom too mad! She's pregnant! A noble is after mine. Well, it could be more than just a noble. Mm hmm. We need her mana. Ooh, they're not gonna like that. She could be a danger to her younger sibling. Ooh, dad don't like that. That is true. She does need to learn how to control her mana to protect herself, to protect her loved ones. Mm hmm. Yo.
You're making adoption sound so good next to that word executed. Good job, Mom. Speak out for the family. Oh, good job, Tuli. Good job keeping people in the loop. Mmm, that's right. I mean, you guys almost lost her multiple times. Oh, she's saying I don't want to turn 10. I like how the head priest is always thinking about what's going to happen next, what's going to happen one after another. That whole poker face works. You don't know what he's thinking about, but he's always thinking. You're defending mine now. <laughs> Oh. Dang. I wouldn't mind being called a fool by him. Good job, good job. We need that resolve. Harassment. Totally harassment. Mm-hmm. Lots of medicine. <laughs> At least there's medicine. Remember when she didn't have any medicine? Ooh, are these to help her later on? Like the last time? What was it? She had a ring? More people will be accompanying her. Who? 
Oh, her future father! And him! What a fellow blue hair dude! Hey! Yes, she's so tiny. Take care of her. <gasps> and that's my reaction to Ascendance of a Bookworm, Episode 29, Season 3, Episode 3. This was so good. Mm -hmm. Getting progress with making more books. Oh yeah, and getting closer to becoming a noble's child. I am really interested in seeing the noble side of this society. Like, I've already seen the commoner side. I want to see the noble side. You know, you think that we've seen all we could from the temple, right? No. That's probably like a quarter, maybe half. Maybe half, but more like a quarter of this world, right? Oh, man. Getting so excited. And they talked about a school. Yo, I know we're not going to see school this season. No way. <laughs> no, uh-uh. Like, we went through two seasons just getting to the temple. Like, gosh. There's no way we're going to see the school in this season. But it'll be interesting if we do see something. But then, oh... The new character that we keep seeing in the promos, the trailers, the clips. The other guy with like purple, bluish hair. Looks blue, but looks also kind of like purple, royal blue. Like what, what color is his hair? Let me know what you think in the comments below. But he has arrived. He's got some spunk. He's got some personality. He's like the opposite of the head priest. It's going to be really interesting. Let me know what you guys thought about this episode in the comments below. What you thought about the video. And if you want to talk outside of YouTube, there's a Discord. Link is in the description. I also stream on Twitch.tv slash Superfina. Outside of YouTube and Twitch, I host podcasts across worlds. We're talking about anime, manga, and other things you're interested in. If you like podcasts like that, link to the podcast is in the description. We're available on all platforms. Other than that, my name is Lehua. And this is the Superfina channel reacting to Ascendance of a Bookworm, episode 29, season 3, episode 3. Hope you guys like this video and we'll see you on the next one. Laters!